Good morning. So if you'd like to cook once, and then eat for the rest of the week. Today is your lucky day because the lovely Cassie Joy with Fed and Fit is here to get us started with a few meal prep yeah. tips and tricks. It's so good to see you. It's so oh, good to be here. We've missed you so much. It's a Kodak moment. <laughs> it's been a while since you've been it's here. It's been a while. You didn't. You weren't a mom the last time you were here. I You're wasn't. a mom now. She's almost one. Wow. She's essentially a she's teenager. She's beautiful. I know, she's practically <laughs> driving. Well, congratulations on your beautiful baby. Thank you so much. And you're still working hard. Yes. So you've got a book coming out. We're going to talk about that in a second. But this all relates to the book. Yep, it does. So let's I'm talk so, meal prep. Let's talk meal prep. So this is a very unique meal prep method. There's, I feel like there's two big problems that it solves, this cook once, eat all week strategy. Meal prep can be a lot of time right? We're either cooking all day Sunday yep. or we're going home and we're cooking for an hour, hour and a half at night time. So this saves a ton of time and it saves a lot of money. It's very okay. budget friendly because we get to buy in bulk. So what okay. we do is we're taking a big protein and we're going to make that in bulk one day. So today we're showing chicken and then two <laughs> kinds of vegetables and you can cheat and use rotisserie chicken for example. So it's really, oh, really buy it already sweet. cooked is what you're yeah, saying. Okay. Yeah. yeah, save yourself the time. And then we're going to do cauliflower and avocados today. Okay. Sounds very gonna, healthy. Very healthy, very healthy meal prep. So what we're going to do is we're going to take those, we've already prepped them, right? The chicken's roasted, and then we're going to assemble those into three different meals. So the first one we're making are stuffed avocados, buffalo avocados. So yummy. And Sounds so wonderful. We've got this shredded chicken that we've already made mm -hmm. on our meal prep date, and we're going to add some hot sauce to that, and then we're going to add a little mayo. I was wondering what okay. that was. Yeah. That's fancy mayo is what it, that is. It is fancy mayo. It's healthy mayo. <laughs> it? I was it like, healthy? which one is what it? What makes yeah. this healthier? It's made with avocado oil instead of canola oil. So it's a little bit better for you. That. Yeah. Okay. So look at this. It's so easy. You just Yum. stir it up and then we're going to stick it right in these beautiful, luscious, keto-friendly avocados. I know. Very popular we right now. We have several people on keto Do here you? on it, staff. Yeah. Yes. Well, they'll love those. And then you stuff all of those and then they go in the oven at 400 for 15 minutes and then dinner's ready. Okay. That's it. Night one, dinner done. Done. Okay, night two, what we're going to talk about is this buffalo, or excuse me, balsamic chicken and cauliflower sheet pan dinner. Totally different from the other night, and it's very simple. So one of those chickens that we roasted, we just deconstructed mm -hmm. really easily, and then we have one of the cauliflowers chopped up. And from there, we're going to drizzle on this yummy dressing of olive oil and vinegar and coconut aminos and Dijon. Which is in your new cookbook. Which is all going to be in the new cookbook. We have 26 weeks worth of meal wow. prep in this cookbook. That's we, a lot of weeks. Y'all, we swung for the fences. <laughs> yeah, you did, girl. You're like, let's just get as cram as much in there as we possibly can. Yeah, totally. The readers really, and then this is just Italian seasoning, garlic, salt, and pepper. Sprinkle it right on top. And then this goes in the oven at 400 degrees for 20 minutes until everything is bubbly and delicious. This is one of my favorites. Cassie, I love yeah. that. So simple. So simple. And then the very last recipe that we've got is this cauliflower cheesy bacon casserole. It is so yummy. So the first part is we took some of those cauliflowers okay. on our prep day and we steamed them and we turned them into a mash, which I added mm -hmm. in with some sour cream, some butter, and then just a little spices. Can I just say Cecily, who's up here right now, our producer, <laughs> she's on the keto diet and her, she's like salivating. <laughs> she's been talking about these cauliflower mashed potatoes for days. Oh my gosh, they're so good, aren't they? Okay, so from there we go, we're gonna add about one and a half cups of Cheddar cheese. I was going to ask which one. Good. Right? Just just let's put it all <laughs> on there. And then these just go in the oven because everything's cooked. We're just putting it in the oven essentially to reheat it and yeah. make help the flavors come together. The chicken. Oh, you're skipping on portions. Yeah, I don't <laughs> no. Wait, now how many? <laughs> I'm <not> messing around. <laughs> how many chickens should we make again? Because I feel like this is a lot. We're I'm just okay doing two it, chickens. This is just two chickens. Two you chickens. Got all this? Okay. Yep, we got okay. all this with two chickens and then a little bacon. And one, on pig. <laughs> <laughs> one pig. Little, little, little piggy. Little piggy. <laughs> exactly. And then we're just going to garnish it with some green onion. And you know, these are, we wrote all of these recipes to make sure that they're very family friendly. Mm -hmm. Everybody can like it. And it's very, they're healthy. And you can choose what you want to do. I am just ecstatic. I can't That's wait to try cool. this. People want your book. And I know they want to get it right now, especially after seeing this. So the book releases March 12th, right? 
close. That okay. it's going to be into April, so April twenty third. Okay. And but they can pre-order it right now. Oh, okay. Yeah. So the better. Best, but where's the best way to do that? Your website? They go to the website or go to Amazon. Cook once, eat all week. It'll pop up. Okay. And for more on Cassie, you can go to fedandfit.com. She's all over social media. I follow her. She's always posting wonderful, fun things. So thank you thank for you being so here. Thank you for having so me. So good to see you. Look good beautiful. To see you. Thank Ready you. To eat. Motherhood looks good on you. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> She's so cute.